Welcome back, MG fam, to the Preview Legacy here on College Hoops 2K8. And after winning our in-season tournament, which was the Drake Iowa tournament, we're going to slide on to our next slew of games. But first, we're going to check out the recruiting, man. So at this point of the season, we're at the top of the board for Emerson Townsend, the 6'7 power forward. Hey, we're his only scholarship offer on the table, and we look to lock him up soon. And next up, we got Jameer Barrett, the 6'3 shooting guard. We're the only scholarship on his board as well, and we're the top school, so we're looking to lock him up as well. And Ernest Mann, the senior power forward from Pasadena, Texas, got us at the number two spot behind ULM. We haven't offered him, but you never know. We might have to if we can't sign those first two guys. And Gene Everson, a point guard, got us all the way down in the sixth place spot. Should we stop even recruiting this kid? Maybe so. So Reggie Conier, the shooting guard, junior, we're climbing up his board slowly but surely. He's only interested in the 18 teams right now. We're number 18. And Jason Hollins, the four-star guy, he has us at number five out of 16 teams. So we got a better shot at getting him, but he's only a sophomore. And now we're going to slide into our first game in this video, which is the South Alabama game. These guys are currently three and two. We're three and one. But their RPI ranking is 113. We have an RPI ranking of number four. All right, so they're a 75 overall squad, and they're led by Coach Graves. Coach Graves has 400 wins under his belt, so we know he knows how to win some games. Last year, his team was three games above 500, and this year, he's currently three and two. And the leading scorer on the squad is Parkinson. He averaging 19, the center, and the second guy up is their shooting guard. So we're here at tip-off in this game. And check out the blue jerseys by South Alabama, bringing some color out here to Prairie View. But we got the first shot up, and Kane makes the first basket. So you got their point guard trying to work their way into the paint. It's not going to work, and Parkinson, their leading scorer, misses his first shot of the game. All right, so Lil Mac out here. Let's see what you can do for us, player. Lil Mac kicks that one over Kane. Gonna kick it over to our boy Stapley and Stapley working to Lil Mac from deep and he misses that one. But Reeves, the guy that's been balling all year long, gets the basket for us. All right, so Lil Mac is out here trying to press the guy in law spins. He has Cammon on him. He puts it up and he misses that one. So a nice rebound from Cammon. Cammon to Lil Mac and Lil Mac has he in trying to get it and look at Stapley. Stapley. Kicks it over to Reeves, back to Lil Mac. Foot on the line this time, but he drains that one. All right, so Stapley over here is going to pull the midi, and it rims in for you, boy. All right, so currently up by six, Stapley lost the ball, and their point guard is pushing it. He has some speed, and the quick fast break layup goes in. All right, so got Reeves down bottom. You already know he's unstoppable from that close. All right, so Law up top with it. He's going to pull a three, misses that one, Parkinson. Got the rebound. He faked out everyone, and he puts it back up. So only up by three this time. We got Big Mac in the game. Being double team already. Stapley from deep. He misses that one, but Big Mac with the rebound. Going to put it up, and he gets his first basket. All right, so Law up top with it. He's going to pull a three after the pump fake. Air ball. Spooner recovers that one, misses that one, but he got another offensive board, and he puts it in. All right, so Big Mac down bottle, quick shot, couldn't get it, couldn't even tip it in either, and Nats got the rebound, but we almost got the deflection that time. All right, so Law is pushing it up court. Nats to Law, and Law, quick take to the basket. Cameron couldn't stop him, so we're only up by one here. Over here in the corner is the point guard who goes all the way to the rack, and he gave his team the lead. All right, so Adams. He's going to kick it to Lil Mac from deep, and Lil Mac can't cash in right there, but he got the steal for your boy, and we kicked it back to him, and Lil Mac redeems himself. All right, so Lil Mac with it once again, got it to Adams. Adams waiting, calling the pick. Yeah, got Miller in there. DJ to the rack. Give it to him. All right, so the point guard up top with Adams on him. He going right to the rack. Once again, this guy is dribbling and driving on us with ease, and then you got their shooting guard. It's going to knock down a three-pointer from the corner. So this team right here is competing against us, man. Their coach is one of the best, like I told you. And he's the reason why they're stealing this game. But check out DJ. DJ is out there putting up some points off the bench. And we're going to kick this one back to Lil Mac. And Lil Mac from three can't get it. But DJ with the rebound. And he puts it in. So DJ off the bench with six quick points. So the game is knotted up right now. Padilla up top. Kicks it down to Parkinson. Back to Padilla. From deep, he misses that one. Parkinson puts it back in for him. So they're killing us on the offensive board. All right, Stapley with it once again going all the way to the rack. 
give it to my boy Stapley. He only has four in the first half, and we have more than three minutes left. And the point going to kick that one down to Spooner. I'm telling you, they're drawing up beautiful plays. And then you got Adams down to Cammon, and Cammon with a basket. All right, so we got Stapley here working off the pick and roll. Got it to Cammon, Cammon contact and all. Let's get it, baby. All right, Padilla up top. He's going to pull a jumper. He misses that one. And Kane slings it up court. Check out Big Mac. Can he go all the way to the rack with it? He will and kiss it off the backboard. Let's go. So at the line, he's going to try to put us up by nine. And he does. All right, so the first half is completed. We finished that one up by nine, even though we were going back and forth for a little while. But I believe we got momentum right now. So we shot over 45% in the first half. And we're out here in the second half with a rebound from Kane. And my boy Stapler, he think he's slowing down. No, sir. He kicks it back to Cammon from NBA range. And Cammon, the power forward slash small forward, can knock those deep shots down. So they're going to pull a deep one himself. And he drained it. All right, so only up by seven here. Nance is going to pull one. He's off Cammon with the rebound, his seventh of the game. And Stapley is working his magic, trying to do something. He's going to kick down over to Cammon from deep once again. And Cammon is the guy that's coming alive in the second half. So at the line, Nance is going to miss this one. Oganoi with that rebound. And McCoy goes all the way to the rack with ease. And then the point guard is going to kick down back to their shooter once again. He misses that one. And Kane slings that one up court. And Stapley, you know he can beat one guy. Well, not that time. All right, so he's going to pull it back out. Kicks it over to Lil Mac. Lil Mac faked them out going to the rack. And yes, sir, Lil Mac out there with it. So down bottom. Big Mac with it this time. You guys better get in front of him. You can't. And he knocks in the reverse layup. So here we're up by nine once again. And Big Mac, you know he's posting. And a nice move right there. He goes up. Give it to our guy. All right, so Big Mac with it once again. Drop steps. Almost lost it. I think he's going up anyway. Yes, sir, he does. And he got a basket. So 11 points for him. And he continuing to dominate down bottom. They can't slow him down. And let's get it. So Padilla with it right now. We're up by 22. And they finally knocked on a three. Akosa is the only guy hitting some jumpers out here. So we're going to try to sling that one. Almost lost it. Reed's got it back. And Cammon will jam it, baby. Let's go. All right, so Lil Mac with it. We got four minutes left. He's going to pull a quick Three, and yes, sir, a little Mac. Drain him, baby. That one right there should have put a knife in him. And then Oganoi with it. What are you going to do? Oganoi sees DJ from deep. Now the three-pointers are falling, baby. All right, so Adams with it this time. He's going to try to push it up court. What are you going to do? Kick it over. DJ once again. You out there too late. And DJ finally heated up late. And we got this victory, 77-63. to 63. We ran the USA Jaguars out of the building in the second half. And the player of the game is Cameron. 17 points, 9 rebounds. Oh, my goodness. One rebound shot of a double-double. A great game from him. Those first two three-pointers in that second half set the tone for us. And now we're going to slide on to our next game where we face the Tar Heels, a top 25 team. They're actually in the top 10. They're number 7 at this moment. They're 8-1. and one. And Coach Roy Williams has over 800 wins, baby. This year, he goes above 800. And now, we're going to have to compete against a team that is prime for the Final Four, as always. Roy Williams is out here coaching another great team, man. They're sporting the 94 overall, and they're great at every aspect of the game. So, last year, they went 32-6, and six, which is remarkable. And this year, they only have one loss under their belt. So, we're going to have our hands full with that center, Fontenot. He is... Averaging 18 points a game. And Sorensen, the shooting guard, is averaging almost 15. All right, so here at Tip Off, we're here in Chapel Hill, baby. Chapel Hill, the state of basketball. Well, college basketball, that is. In North Carolina, we got the first basket. All right, and then Sorensen going to pull that three. And you already know he's a shooter. And Lil Mac is out here looking for that pick. We're going to try to play the ball inside. And we got Reeves in there. That's what I'm talking about. So, 4-3 to three right now. We got the lead. Let's see if we can get another one. Look at Reeves. Reeves is out there banging with the best of them. So, we got Reeves on the pick again. We're going to keep using these dudes. They cannot stop Reeves. And Reeves is continuing his charge this season. And Lil Mac is going to pull a deep one. Couldn't get it. And Bonham with that rebound. They're kicking it up court. And check out Sorensen. What kind of alley was that? That was just ferocious. He threw it behind his head. They're playing with us. So, we're going to give it back to Reeves. And Reeves kicks it over to Cameron. Cameron from deep and he knocks down a three that's his favorite spot and Clark this time 
He's working his magic, trying to pull a jumper in the paint, and it goes in. What? We should have blocked that one. So we're still up by four, even though this team right here seems like they can't miss. Lil Mac is going to pull a three and cashes that one in. Let's go, baby. So Clark kicks that one to Sorison. Sorison misses it off the front of the rim, but their center, Fontenot, the leading scorer, gets the basket. All right, so K inbounds that one to McCoy. Lil Mac, that is, and Staple is going to try to go all the way and Staple with that basket. Let's get it, baby. All right, so Clark with it here. Kicks it over. Maldonado from deep. Yo, everybody can shoot on this squad. So Clark with it once again. Nielsen down bottom. And Bonner, that guy has hops. That's the guy that caught the alley earlier. We got to watch him. So Bonner kicks that one over. Sorensen, he's looking. Kicks it back to Carato, and he misses that one. Nice rebound. What? They gave them the goal 10? That's crazy. So 16 to 17. And look at my boy Stapley. He's going to go all the way with it. Couldn't get it. Man, I thought he would have at least got a foul call that time. And Sorensen is going to pull a three man in his face. He roasted my boy Cameron. So you got Bonner kicking that one to Nielsen. Man, in his face. Yo, these guys have blinders on. And check out Stapley. Stapley's going to kick that one over to Kane. And Kane from deep. Yes, sir. Finally, he can hit him when we need him. So Nielsen over there with it. Nielsen kicks that one down to Fortnite and Fortnite misses that one. Carato got blocked and Fortnite got blocked as well. They continue to get off of the boards and they finally got the basket, bro. Come on. So we got Adams with it this time, pushing it up court. You already know he's looking for my boy Big Mac and Big Mac pulls the rim down. He's too big for him. And Nielsen going to the rack contact. No, sir. We're going to take this one. And Lil Mac, what you got for us? Kicks that one back to Big Mac, and Big Mac coming off the bench, giving us some valuable minutes. And they're going to try to pull a three here. No, sir, but Fortnite got it back, and we couldn't stop him in the paint. All right, so over here in the corner, Kane, what you going to do? Kane kicks that one over to Lil Mac. Lil Mac caught him slipping off his feet, and he's going to pull a three, and he catches it in, baby. Let's go. So Carato with it. He kicks it over to Clark. Maldonado, what you got, Carato? Back to Nielsen. From midi, yo, they can find the open shooter with ease. So you got Carato right here. It's working, trying to spin. Gets into the paint, got a block, baby. And check out Bonner kicking it out. Got to Sorensen, and you know wide open he's going to drain it. So they have the lead right now up by three. They're going to kick down over to Carmichael off the bench. He misses that with Sorensen with the rebound, sending it to the crib. But Maldonado able to get the ball back, and they scored. So Carmichael with it once again. Got it down to Maldonado. We got to be able to stop this dude. All right, so with less than two minutes left, man, we're down by almost double digits, and Stapley with a beautiful take that time. So Stapley with it once again. We're going to try to work through him. See if he can get to the rack once again. Ah, uh, he got blocked really easy that time. And Clark is going to push it. And he's going to pull a three. And he drains it. So we're only down by eight here. And Fontenot going to kick down to Clark once again. And Clark has the hot hand at the end of the first half. And we will go into halftime with a 10-point deficit. He knocked that one down at the buzzer there. And that one hurt. But we got to continue to keep our head in the game. Even though we're down by 10, this is a top 10 school. Arguably a top 5 school in the nation. But we're competing, maybe. We're competing. This team is not as good as it was last year. Talking about our squad. But we're still in this one. And check out Reeves. Out of the break. Sending him to the crib. But we still couldn't stop fighting him. That dude is getting every offensive board he can find. And Cameron, he's going to kick that one to Reeves. And Reeves, got it, baby. Let's go. So we still in here. Clark to Maldonado. Clark to Sorison, over to Bonner, the flyer, and he drains a three. I'm working the pick. Let's see if we can get in the paint, and that's what I'm talking about. Reeves is not phased today. He's balling with these guys. He has 12 points. So Bonner over there with it. We tipped that one, but we couldn't get it back, man. We just can't catch a brick against this squad. So McCoy is going to get it. Little Matt, what you got, baby? What you got? Keep the speed. He's going to kick that one over to Reeves. Back to Cammon. Cammon will drain that one, baby. That's what I'm talking about. So Stapley kicks that one over to Kane from deep. He couldn't hit that one. Bonner with the rebound. Carroll with it. What is he going to do? Kick it down to Nielsen. Yo, we gave him too much space down there. So we out here on the inbound. Couldn't get anything. So Carroll with it once again. Kicks that one over to Clark. Clark back to Carroll. Carroll looking for something. Kicks it over to Nielsen. Hand in his face and he drains another one. So this team is finally taking off, man. Everybody is gelling at the right time. And Bonner with a nice drop step. But we allowed the small guy to get the offensive board. We got to improve when it comes to rebounding. He's over to Carroll from deep. And that one rims in. Like I said, everything is going for these guys. Clark is with it right now. Clark 
working, kicks that one over to Nielsen. We're there, hand in his face. The guy's too short for him, but he still got the shot up, and they got the offensive board after the miss. So Maldonado, Caratel up top. He's kicking that one over to Clark. Too much room for him, and yo, this team is going crazy. So Caratel up top with it once again. They kicks that one to Bonner and Bonner. The flyer, man. The flyer has like three dunks in this game. I don't think anyone has dunked this many times against us in any game we play so far in this series. And check out the quick take from Carato. He has 10 points. Back to Carato up top. Carato with it. No Maldonado from deep, and he drains a three. So these guys are mopping the floor with us here in the second half, and they're not slowing down. Every shot is going in, and we're going to continue to try to compete. You know we're not going to lay down and check out my boy Stapley from deep. Uh, he couldn't get one, so we're going to try to get it here. There's Stapley, hey, got his hands on something. Let's go, man. So with four minutes left in this game, we're down by 16, and we're pushing the issue, and Lil Mac will take it to the rack, and we're not going away. So Clark, he's going to pull one, get that out of there. Reeves with a nice block. I thought he was going to get the shot up or a foul, and Stapley is going up. Gets the basket for so we're back within 12. So Clark with it. He's trying to get to the right. Kicks that one back to Maldonado. And check out the speed, bro. The speed. He blew past everyone. And Fontenot going to kick that one over to Clark. And Clark with an easy take to the basket. And we're back down by 15. But Stapley going to try to keep us alive. All right. So Clark up top right now. Kicks it down to Bonner. And Bonner misses that one. He puts it in. And so Maldonado down bottom. He goes up, misses that one, another offensive board source in his time, and he makes it over our center. So that's going to wrap up our game here against North Carolina, man. We competed, man, competed, especially in that first half, but the second half, things got crazy. And Sorensen is the player of the game. He went 4 for 15, so that was some great defense played against him. But he knocked down three three-pointers, which were big. 13 points, 4 rebounds, 4 assists, and 5 steals. So he did it all on the court. And both teams shot fairly well. When it came to turnovers, man, we had less than 10. They had 19, so we played great defense. But look at the rebounds, bro. 18 to 42. We couldn't get anything off of those guys. So their offensive boards was like 19 to our four. So you know this team wins when they get those second chance points. So Reeves was our leading scorer with 19. Stakely had 18. We had a lot of players with double-digit points, but... Yo, we just needed 10 more from somebody else. So I guess Reeves would have had to score like 24 and Stapley would have had to score 23 for us to tie this thing up. But I appreciate these guys' effort and I appreciate you guys for watching this video. Hit that like button, that notification bell, and subscribe to the channel, man. It's your boy McGruff and I'm out. One.